Ephesians 5, 11 to 12. Take no part in the unfruitful works, work of darkness, but instead expose them, for it is shameful even to speak of the thing that they do in secret. Read it, my friend. Ephesians 5, 11 to 12. It tells us to take no part in ungodly things that the, the, the unequal, you know, the people against God do daily. Do not take part on this thing, but instead, he said, expose them. Expose them. For it is shameful even to speak of the thing that they do. My friend, we need to take side because Jesus says, if you're not with me, you against me. These people, these people that take sides, they decide, you know, they use the free will to do wrong. So we cannot be promoting this kind of stuff. We need to promote the word of God. That's what we need to do. We need to promote God and his love. Uh, for instance, to some people, God give a beautiful voice. Some people, they give, uh, God give um, many, many uh, talent, and they use it against him. Um, there are a lot of singers today that they become rich over the night using the talent that God gave them. They use it against God. They use it to do bad, wrong stuff. For instance, let's remember what's going on with uh, Celine Dion. She has a beautiful voice, but when? When has she used it to praise the Lord? Lately, she even created a uh, children, babies clothing, you know, that in which she's removing the children's sex. It's like a unisex, it's like a, a everybody fit one sex, something like that. This lady is going against the word of God because God gave us our sex when we were created in our mother's womb. And she's going against this principle. This is a biblical, this is a godly principle. She's going against God. Now, my friend, she's suffering. She has a very horrible disease that is painful. One in one million of people get it. One in one million of people. You can see then the curse. You can see then that the devil took possession because he gave, fictitiously, he gave at the beginning, but then he claimed that person. Then he take possession over that person that opened his heart to him. My friend, prevent this thing to happen to you and do not adore the devil. Do not promote the devil in any way. Well, I thought this was a very powerful message to share today. God bless you, my friend, and keep praying for your family because things are hard right now and they're not going to get easy, easier based on what the Bible says. God bless you all.